guys, welcome to Real Life of a Teacher. I'm Claire and today I'm going to share with you a summer school slash summer vacation haul. So this is some clothing that I have acquired over the last maybe month or so. Um, some of it I wore right at the end of the school year. I am finally out of school. Today is my second day off of school. Um, so yesterday I slept a whole bunch, laid around, didn't do much. Uh, and so today I thought I would get back into filming now that things are a little bit less crazy. So some of it I've worn already because it was hot at the end of school. Some of it I know I will wear during summer school and in the fall. Um, and some of it is definitely vacation clothing. So I thought I would show you everything and then I will also stick some um, light cutaways of me wearing some of these things. I haven't done a video like this since I don't know maybe last summer or early in the fall so it's been a while um, but yeah hope you enjoy so the first thing that I got I they look a little much but I love them and they're shockingly comfortable and I wore them to school a lot and I will continue to wear them this summer so they are these ridiculously high wedges but because the front part is so wedgy uh, <laughs> so wedgy Clearly I spent all my time with middle schoolers. So because the front part has such a high wedge, the, the angle's not bad, and because it straps around your ankle, they're like super duper comfy, and I love them. Um, I got these at Marshall's, and of course, as soon as I bought them, they went on clearance. So yeah, they're on clearance now, which is annoying because I've paid, I mean, probably still like $25, but um, I paid, and now they're on clearance. So another Marshalls find that I have that I have not worn yet, I'm going away next week for vacation for about a week and a half down to Florida. We're going down to the Keys. Um, and I thought these would be good beach shorts, Shane says. My boyfriend says that they look like pajamas, but they're not pajamas. And I thought they'd be nice and comfy and flowy for when we are in Florida and it's hot. This is a Target find. I do love me some Target and it's definitely wrinkly because I just pulled it out of the laundry basket. Um, this is, I always have a green dress like this. So every time I get rid of one, I end up getting another one. This one actually I got from my mom. Um, I love this color green. If you've seen any of my other hauls, I feel like there's always something this color. Um, but it has this nice little sort of crisscross detail in the back, which is a little bit different than any of my other green dresses. Um, I think I have three right now, but this one's currently my fave. And I will say this is also, yeah, this is a small and I typically wear a medium, um, but I'm very short. I'm only about 5'2". Um, so I like this smaller size because it is like stretchy and t-shirty material and it doesn't go too long because sometimes it's, you'll see in the other, the other shot of it, um, but it's sort of just loose fitting. It doesn't really, you know. It's very loose. Um, so if it were too long, it would look really baggy and not that cute. So it's small. I definitely recommend sizing down if you are a shorter person like me. Whew. So I'm sweating because it's hot. It's like 80 some odd degrees and I have all my windows closed and the fans off so that it doesn't make that horrible fan noise. Um, this is another Target find. Um, it is this little t-shirt and it ties down at the bottom. So this is one that I wore the last couple days of school. It'll be super comfy throughout the summer and in the fall again when it's warm and it's got this little loop detail in the back. Oh, I just thought of one other Target thing that I have that I recently got. I'll be right back. <laughs> so, this is one that I don't know if you can still get. I think I got this one, mm, this one's a little older, this one I maybe got like six weeks ago, um, and it was in the clearance section, so you probably can't get it. But if you can, I highly recommend it. It is adorable. I feel like I'm five, but it is this little um, like overall jumper dress that's got this cute little flower print on it. Um, 
yeah, I feel like a child when I wear it, but it's super comfy. You can wear like a bodysuit or just a t-shirt underneath of it. Uh, love this. All right, so a couple other Marshalls things. I got this t-shirt. It's in like the junior section for like $9.99 or something. I'm sort of on the edge, I'll be 27 this summer. I'm kind of on the edge of feeling like I can't shop in the junior section anymore, but I probably will because it's so cheap. Um, but I do always have this fear because Marshalls is sort of the only place like really local um, that I can go shopping regularly. Um, so I, same as for my students, so I have this fear that I'm gonna buy something in the junior section and then match <laughs> one of my students, which almost happened at graduation with the outlets that are kind of near us. One of my eighth graders showed up in a dress that I had almost bought for graduation and I was really glad that I didn't because that would have been awkward. So it's just this t-shirt, um, sort of this mauve, mauve, purpley gray, I don't know what you call this, um, t-shirt and then it has this sort of wrap around in the front part that I really like. And this next thing is definitely not school. It is full on vacation. I mean, maybe I could wear it with like a cardigan. I don't, I don't think I'll ever wear this to school. I probably won't wear this ever not on vacation. It's very, it's very vacation with the leaves. And so it's a spaghetti strap, um, romper, but it's like sh cropped pants romper. Um, very flowy, very vacation. I saw this and thought, oh, that'll be perfect for when we're in Florida. So I went to the outlets two weeks ago, mm -hmm. recently, um, to get a couple of things because I didn't really have good, I do, I have plenty. I didn't feel like I had enough spring and summer stuff that I could wear to school. So I went down to the outlets near me and I only went into Banana Republic and Loft, but really, really good deals. So one of the things is this dress that I'm wearing right now. Um, it has these thick straps, it buttons. Ooh, hello, button. It buttons all the way down, but you can leave it unbuttoned if you want to. So like I often stop buttoning it at my knees so I can get a little breeze. Um, this was 60% off the clearance. So the tag said it was like $130 or something. That's expensive. Thank you, Kathleen Lights. Um, so really expensive, way more than I would ever pay for anything. Um, but it was on clearance. It was 60% off clearance. So I got it for like $20. Um, it fits me perfectly and it, I got it in a four um, and I'm very short as I already said so if you are a tall person this is not gonna be a floor like maxi for you which is why I'm inclined to think it was on clearance because um, for me it's the perfect length maxi dress which never happens I'm way too short so I think if you're unfortunately if you're a taller person I don't think this will work for you but if you are a shorter person like me it's perfect Um, so I also went to Loft when I went down to the outlets and I got this cute little elephant print skirt. Um, just like the dress, it's got pockets, which I love. Um, got lots of compliments on it the couple times that I wore this to school and super comfy. Got an elasticized waist. I'm all about that. And then the last things I got at Loft, they had t-shirts buy one get two free. They also had cardigans buy one get two free, which I should have I should have gone for, but I talked myself out of it because in theory, I wear less cardigans in the summer. Definitely not true. Um, the thing I will say about Loft that I should have said about this skirt, I am a medium. This skirt is an extra small. Talk about vanity sizing, it's obnoxious. I know some people are all about it because you feel little. It's obnoxious. I tried on a medium and it literally fell off of my body. So, 
size down because I got these t-shirts in a size medium, not thinking after I had had the experience with the skirt, just grabbed them on my way out. I got them in a medium and they are definitely sort of looser t-shirts than what I often wear, which isn't a bad thing. They shrunk a little bit in the dryer, but you'll see them on there a little looser than what I often wear. Um, but this one is just a white one and then it's got this this gold, oh my gosh, it looks so fancy and shiny in my lights, but it's got this gold and black print on the front. Cute uh, t-shirt that is a little different, but still very wearable, obviously. Um, then I got this one, which I had one very similar to and then spilled all over it and ruined it. Um, it was more blue. This one's a little bit more green, but I really like it. It's just, again, a white t-shirt with this sort of green and blue and yellow print on the front. The other one I had was a lot just more blue. This one's a lot more green, but I really like this t-shirt. And then... I just got a plain old pink one that I like to wear tucked into that elephant skirt. There's a little bit of pinky stuff on the bottom, so I feel like it brings that out without me just wearing a white t-shirt with it, which is kind of what I always do with patterned things on the bottom. So this one allows me to do something a little different. All right, so that is my haul and try on. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. I am sure that I will be doing more of these as school begins to approach later in the summer. I don't want to get ahead of myself, but once I do school shopping, I'll do this again. These videos in the past have been fairly popular, so just comment down below if you have um, any suggestions for videos or any suggestions for places where I can get a good deal on some cute clothes.